Hey everyone, welcome back to The Hunter, Call of the Wild. This will be episode 2 of our Let's Hunt series. Now, looks like we're going to be hunting ourselves some deer at... What? Yo. What? Are you ser... Are you serious? Did that deer actually... <laughs> Yo, that deer actually just spawned right in front of us. Oh my god. Oh man. That was insane right there. I never... I've never seen anything like that happen, ever. I mean, I don't play this game too much, but oh my god, that that was weird. Let's see if we could spot that that deer. Is it around here? Uh, how do we get the flashlight working? Oh, there we go. Alright, I can't really see shit. Uh, yo, it looks like it's beaming from above. I don't even care. Let's just get right into it. Alright, guys. Well, we are out on the search for some deer. Oh man, it's a pretty open field here. A lot of grass. Yo, there's a... What? Yo, that's a freaking black bear. Oh man, I've never seen one of those. I mean, hardly actually. I mean, I've never actually got up and close with one like this. Let's see if we can take a shot at it. Boom. Oh, did we get it? Crap, I don't even know if we got it. I think I compensated too much for... uh for bullet drop, I'm not entirely sure. Um, crap. I'm not entirely sure if uh, we even got him. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and uh, kind of make our way over to him. That's assuming we even hit him. Uh, and uh, hopefully he doesn't run off on us. Yep. Yep, that's, uh, that's that black bear that we shot at. That's the warning call. Didn't seem like it was that far away. I'm, I'm trying to see if I can get a shot at it. I'm not sure yet. Let's see if we can inch closer. Oh, what's going on over here? Oh, we got a uh, black-tailed deer. Looks like it's uh, trying to put out its mating call. It seems like it's nearby, actually. Uh, just within that tree line over there. Probably on top of the hill, too. Uh, but I'm not entirely sure if we're going to hit that guy. Uh, let's see if we can go up ahead and uh, try to... Oh, yep, there's the black bear. It's giving off its warning call, so... Might be uh, trying to get away from us at this point. Um, I'm not sure if we should hit that deer first, because that might be... Oh. Boom. Alright, we got him. Oh, oh man. Well, looks like he took off on us, but it did look like we knocked him right off his feet. So, yeah, he should drop soon, because when we shot him, it looked like it hit something pretty dang critical. So, hopefully he doesn't lead us on a, uh, a wild uh, goose chase. So, let's see if we can go get that bear and uh, see if he dropped it all, that deer. Well, guys, 15 to 20 minutes later... Um, I was chasing after that black bear because I couldn't find this guy. Oh my god, he led me on that damn goose chase. My god, he was all the way... We were all the way over there. And, uh, yeah, wow, he, uh, he really got far. Didn't think he would get this far, though. Oh man, he's not too big, so wouldn't assume a really high score for, uh, for this guy. Alright, so what do we got here? I, uh, what is this, a 143-pound male? Uh, pretty common, very easy, so, yeah, pretty low score for that one. Um, not too much cash for this one. Doesn't seem like even so much as a bronze or whatever. So, um, didn't even look like I hit anything vital. Yep, done, I didn't even hit anything vital, I just made him bleed. Oh, got another call over here. What is this? What's going on over here? Hello. Show yourself, commie bastard. Up. Oh, I see you in the tree line. There you are. Up. Oh, that's a female. Um. Should I kill it? Oh man, to kill or to not kill. Ah. Uh, you know what? I'm not entirely sure if we should. I think what we really want to go for are the uh, the males. 
Let's just, let's continue on. I don't really think we need a female right now. Alright, so in the meantime, guys, I kind of, uh, kind of swapped out my, uh, 243 for the 223 Descent, and, uh, yeah, this black bear just, uh, kind of appeared outside of the, uh, not too far from the, uh, the outpost that I just unlocked. So we are going to go see if we can, uh, if we can get it. She better not walk away, though. I swear, they always walk away. Even though I'm super silent. I swear. Let's see if we can uh, possibly move over towards this way just to kind of intercept her. I'm trying to keep an eye on my noise meter. I'm trying to make sure that I don't cause her to get scared. Seems like she's just right here. I might be able to get a shot from here. Yeah, possibly. Let's see. Oh, there she is. See if we can get her. Boom. Oh, that didn't get her. Shoot. I think that second shot might have missed. Looked like it did anyhow. Let me see if I can find her. Come on, pop. Oh, there you are. Boom. Got you. I figured that third shot would have gotten her. Though that could have only been two shots, not quite sure. Let's see what we got here. Doesn't seem very big, so... How you doing? Sorry, I just shot you multiple times. Alright, so... 162 pound female. Difficulty 2 minor. Not entirely sure how, you know, how good that would be. But uh, it's a bronze, and uh, the trophy type would be Skull. Thankfully, I kind of preserved her head. You know, I almost blew her freaking head off, I swear. But then again, with a rifle, I guess you'd have to be kind of up and close just to do some real damage like that. I don't know. But, um, yeah, we, uh, we, pre we preserved the Skull, and uh, 428's our score. We got over 1,100 dollars from that from that go man seems like I shot it three times actually so yeah looks like uh, looks like we did pretty damn good here so all right let's move on to our next target so at this point guys I've been basically tailing this uh, deer here um, at least I just kind of came across them and uh, a couple other deer, but those are female. So let's see if we can hit this one. Boom! All right. Let's see here. Oh, he ran off. Let's uh, let's go get him, guys. I'm not sure if we hit anything vital, but uh, yeah, we'll see in just a second. All right. So yep, it was a vital hit. So should shouldn't have gone far and here he is oh, he didn't get too too far but you know he uh, he put up a good fight um, seem yeah he doesn't seem too big but uh yeah he died in a bit of an awkward position sorry buddy so sorry oh man anyway what do we got here we got a hundred and forty nine pound male we uh, shot him or well at least we tracked him from nearly point thirty yards very easy uh, we didn't really get too much out of it he is a bronze uh, we did puncture his right lung so you know was a vital hit so yep scores 591 and uh, yeah, we got just under what a nearly a little over nine hundred dollars for that you know not bad so all right yeah it looks like that's all we punctured so all right hmm so at this point we might as well just go ahead and claim him so all right 
I think what I'm going to do now is uh, try to get someone else because I'm kind of running low on ammo. Probably just uh, see where else we can go and uh, get them. So let's... Uh, oh. oh, that's a female, so who cares. Anyhow, let's uh, get hunting on our last animal for the day. And wouldn't you know it, he's actually nearby. Just kind of spotted him here, so I'm going to take him out. Alright. I hope I hit something vital. It didn't seem like he dropped. I'm not entirely sure. I'll have to go ahead and, uh, and see real quick. Let me see where he's heading, so that way I don't lose him. There he is. Looks like I might have hit something. He might. He looks injured. I'm not sure if it's because of the uh, the rain effect that you know he walks like that. Um, not entirely sure, but uh, seemed to have walked over in that tree line. Could have made a left turn or a right turn. Of course, if he made a right turn, he would have came out of the tree line. But anyway, we're gonna go see what's up with him. Yep. Looks like we made another vital hit. Let's go see if uh, I can follow this trail. Uh, looks like a medium blood trail, anyhow. Let me see if I can actually trace his steps. He might have not gone far, because it was a vital hit. So, uh, might have dropped somewhere around here. Somewhere not too far away. Jeez, he really did uh, get quite a distance. Wait. One of them's trotting over here. There he is. Shit. Oh, shit. What? Yo, man, I had him at a really damn close range. What was that? Oh, my God. Whatever. We hit him from a... Yeah, we got a vital hit on him from a really close range, so... He definitely dropped around here. Um, probably up ahead just past the trees so um, yeah I, I couldn't find that other deer I don't get if that that couldn't have been him I don't think it was him at least uh, but yeah we're gonna go ahead and we are gonna track this one down because it seems like we can't really recover the other one well doesn't seem like he got too far um, yeah no I'm surprised he didn't drop right where he was I don't know if you guys saw it but he basically teleported uh, after I shot him. He, like, got up, teleported once, and then he fucking hauled ass. Oh, my God. Anyway, what do we got here? 140-pound male. I figured he didn't look that big. Um, tracking distance, not too far. Um, scores 558. Uh, we only got $900 from that. Um, seems like I hit him in the, uh, in the left lung and uh, some other places. Yep, I hit him twice. Hmm. Alright, well, seems like this is our uh, last deer for the episode, guys. I want to thank you guys for watching this episode. Leave a like and a comment down below if you enjoyed the video. Uh, I'll be sure to get working on episode 3 if you guys are still interested. Uh, I might upload some more Call of Duty content if you're also interested in that. And uh, yeah, be sure to subscribe for more content, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching.